The right measurements in your bra are the foundation or the starting point to the fit. You need to make sure it's correct to take you throughout your day. To find your perfect fit, put on your favorite underwire bra, just the one that's your go-to. It doesn't matter if it has holes in it, just put it on so we know where to start. Contrary to popular belief, you get the most support from the band of your bra. The band should be straight across your back, under your shoulder blades, and you should be able to comfortably fit two fingers underneath the band. Start on the loosest hook and tighten if you need to. If you're able to pull the band of your bra more than two inches off your back, you probably need to tighten it a little bit more or go for a smaller size. The properly fitting cup should hold your breast without cutting into you. The front of your bra where the underwire meets should sit flat on your breastbone. Cups that are too small bulge at the sides, over the top or under the arms. Cups that are too big, quite easy to spot. <laughs> they wrinkle and gape. You can see that much more visually than you can a cup that's too small. Raise your arms up over your head. That's a really easy way to see if your bra is fitting. Your breast should stay in your bra <laughs> when you lift your arms up over your head. Your bra strap should fit pretty comfortably on your shoulders. The bra strap dent is a clear, clear sign that your bra doesn't fit. And it's really uncomfortable if you've worn something like that all day long. When you slide your straps down onto your shoulder, your bra should stay into place. It shouldn't move. So then you know you're wearing the correct size. You could always adjust your straps regularly. Oftentimes after you wash something, you'll need to readjust. But make sure when you put your bra on, especially if you have the time to adjust it properly you'll be more comfortable.